hi welcome back to my channel in case you are just new here this is Mazda with travel and tours we are here to help you with your travel inquiries to know what's going on to know how the place you wanted to go to looks like what it's like you know things you can be able to get over there you know this and that how you can be able to establish you know kind of faster and um, about ticketing inquiries about visa stuff anything at all that's what we're here for so um, make you no worry you understand so just let us know in case um, um, you are you don't really understand what we are doing here or you don't really understand my video or kind of and you want to know uh, deep about one or two things just no Allah get my contact my whatsapp number it's over there just get it there chat me up on whatsapp eh? then no while i can be able to answer your questions regarding whatsoever reason about you know traveling stuff and all that that's what we're here for so so that is it um our main topic today i'm um, gonna be like um for the guys here in dubai uae you know side hustling you know things you can be doing to be getting some small small change you understand yeah and also i'm gonna share with you guys how i've been surviving throughout this corona corona stuff you know things i've been doing getting some small small money from it and all that so that is it you know we should be our brothers keepers you know uh, that's why i'm here to brief you guys how i've been surviving with my families you know the little things i'm you know doing invest my money on and the things i can as in, i've been doing currently here yes so that's all about this video for today so let us go quickly uh to what we are here for and before then sorry i think i'm forgetting for the people that uh, uh that have been supporting me thank you very much i do really appreciate and the ones which uh i mean the new ones among us please do subscribe and as well as to put the notification button so you know when i don't put something new so this is it um now going to our topic for today we see this is uae uh, and we've got a lot of things going on here which many of us don't really have an idea of yes or how to do it perhaps so now here am i today telling you that you can actually be doing your work as in like people that are working you know you can be doing your job and as well as be doing some side hustling which is legal here so now one of those side hustling which many don't really know that you can be getting some small small change from it although i'm not really doing this one but i have so i mean like i've got a lot of friends of mine that are into it which is this money exchange money exchange you guys know what i'm saying here this is like uh, down my building there i've got one uh, Igbo guy that is doing it over there in the next building over there i've got someone who is doing it see that stuff is a lucrative business but because uh we like most nigerians we don't uh really believe in a small small something you know you can actually start from somewhere you know we need to get it fast and immediately so this is it those guys currently now the rate i don't really know about the calculation you know how to do it well but i'm just telling you guys as per my experience you know so now well a friend of mine which i'm sending from and the one down my building they are sending now as in like sending from here to nigeria before before this corona started they used to send uh, naira to dirhams were, no dirhams to naira was one dirham was around 95 98 yeah something of that sort 95 90, then until now you got to 98 100 naira per one dirhams so now now corona started everything scattered dollar everything naira everything so now currently they are sending naira i mean dirhams to naira now it's 120 123 124 around that remember what i told you before before now they used to send 95 98 so but now they are sending 123 124 125 depends on the person so now you see the difference here now apart from that before now if you are one as in if you want to bring money from nigeria like me people normally send money for my eyes and for me to make visa for them to book ticket and also people that i'm doing business for now sending that money from nigeria let's assume you are sending 100 naira uh, sorry 100,000 naira from nigeria to, to uae now you will get exactly 1000 dirhams that was before i mean before this corona started now you get 1000 dirhams exactly but right now if you are sending 100 naira 
I mean 100,000 Naira. Oga, you're not getting more than a... I think you're not getting more than 700 dirhams if I'm not mistaken or less than that so you see 30 something thousand naira it's gone you get the point here you get the mathematics here you get the mathematics here that money there for people where they send that money you get the point it's like investing so now that money will be there so when everything will go back to normal imagine how much you have made per 100,000 naira see I don't really know the calculation like I said before too well but i'm just telling you what it's going on these are cool lucrative business but we don't really know and for us it's like ah, ah i beg i don't have that time okay you should have that time oh yes you should have that time with your just two thousand dirhams two thousand dirhams you can you can start that business yourself you know how you can do it download the application of your bank which bank you they use zenet bank uba access bank download the application from app store business don't start to i saw it in bio then you have like at least 100k for your niger account just start small small 100k for your niger account then in dirhams you have like 1000 dirhams or 2000 depends business don't start to you don't borrow anybody you don't get any not that that's how you start your business those guys are making it my dear and you too can do it mostly people that lives in accommodation you know in a company the industrial areas like this whereby you cannot be able to travel all the way from there to come to that city like where i'm living now to come and change your money to come and get naira or come and send naira you can be doing it there tell your friends there. tell your colleagues the niger colleagues there oh okay? god you don't start with that so before they you go send one or two you don't make money will be say you're gonna add from the one will be say you get to start that business then that's what it's in be that is number one yes and you can actually start like this i know couple of what am i even saying the guys that are doing that in, uh, i mean right there at uh, i mean where i used to live before the guy brought his brother two of them they are now three this is what they do see what they do they don't even i mean you know have resident visa they have tourist no doesn't they usually go for tourist visa they came with tourist visa they are doing this this is their business they are paying rent with this money they are making from that business three brothers i'm telling you guys so what they are doing they will come with three months visa once the visa is about to expire they will go for visa change that was then before this corona started they will go for visa change that is how they are doing so now tell me if they're not making it how would they be getting that money for the visa change it's a common sense you too can start it mostly when you are living where there is a lot of nigerians okay you can start it but many of us doesn't know this because for us we need where we can be able to walk this come on we can be getting your small small money at home by doing nothing yeah so this is number one so now number two here um number two number two number two number two uh, i've got so many of them yeah but if i will say all of them which i've got here some of my friends might not be happy with me <laughs> because i don't spoil business for them <laughs> Niger, hey, we get problem, shall we? Get problem. <laughs> so this is number one. So let me go to the one which I'm doing. I be, I was as in I've been doing, and I'm still doing it. So this one is like, I mean, this one, yeah, this one, you don't invest anything, but it's, this one needs your time. Yes, people that are working, they don't really need uh, this one because uh, you need time. So this is it. Now, guys. I have been doing this very one when I was working with my with my previous no with my three previous companies with the security back in 2012 yes so this is this is how it goes for my Facebook if you go to my Facebook if you go to my whatsapp status for my uh, messenger all I am posting is my business which I don't even own any of those business you know how it goes I will go to a certain store in Dera, in Ajman, I will take pictures of some beautiful clothes, clothing, women, stuff, panties, boxers, wristwatches, gold necklaces, you know, those beautiful, beautiful things, uh, ribbon, uh, eyeglasses, a lot of them. I will post on my WhatsApp. I will post on my YouTube, I mean, I mean uh, sorry, my Facebook. Yeah. One thing about businesses, 
in most cases social media business doesn't you know you don't just blow in one day it might take months it might take one year before someone will recognize that ah ah i think i've seen this from this person's world sometimes some the person will now call you to ask or chat you up that is how i started I used to post those things randomly, you know, like just post normal post. You know, I see things, something which I love, in, I like, I like in Dubai Mall. I'll just post on my wall, and it pays. From my cousin's sister, she saw that she was like, "Ah, my brother, can you help me to check on this? I saw you are posting something like this. Do you have an idea about uh, uh, this one? That was then Brazilian hair. Yeah, can you check for me this and that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yes, no problem. So then I was having an uh, issue kind of because I was working then, you know, you don't really have time. You know, our shift then, now when I was security, if I changed to sales, I changed to sales, and I changed to sales again. So sometimes you do nine hours, 10 hours, 12 hours. So you don't really have time. So it was only on my day off. So <clears throat> then I was struggling, I'll be doing it also, and I'm surviving, and I'm, to be honest with you, I, I used to get a lot of money from that business then, buying something for people, and I would send to them in Nigeria. Now, during this corona, there was a business which I made uh, for a friend of mine. So he sent me samples, I should go and check for him, which I did perfectly. I sent to him, <sighs> my dear you too can make it i don't want to go far i don't want to go deep about this but i'm telling you what i'm doing currently what i'm <clears throat> doing to survive what i'm i have gotten huge amount of money from this business apart from my visa business which, which i'm doing this tourist what i mean uh, aviation stuff booking tickets my dear i'm a full-time hustler i buy things for people check my whatsapp status check my facebook i don't post nonsense sometimes i do post joke but in most cases i i post about businesses just picture post it there you can never tell someone might like it and they will call you i will go even though you don't even have time you can as well ask someone else to check send me i will go and check for you i will give you your own percentage this one is no yahoo this one is no illegal this one is lego even though you don't have time let me know someone has sent me car some time ago to go and check for him that's so i don't want to tell you guys how many you know like how as in like you know the thing will come on top but you guys know what i'm saying i'm a full-time hustler and i want you to become a full-time host i don't want you to be complain i want you to stop this complaint about this country that you are this you don't have this you don't. i want you to be doing something that time we'll be saying they spend on social media use it to check use it to go around go to the mall close to you take pictures and post on your social media platform your own might hit one day. If you don't have time, let me know. I will go and check for you. I will give you your own money, your own commission when it when everything it pays. That is me. Yeah, but I want to be doing something. That's how I've been surviving during this corona. You know, service another work again. I no ticket anymore. Now this is not a survival. I don't lie you. I don't make something where we say I use and they pay rent during these critical times. Yeah. So I'm telling you, I'm advice, I'm pushing you, I'm motivating you, I'm encouraging you to start doing side hustling. Stop depending on your salary. It didn't hit me bad then when I was working with companies. Yeah, it hit me because before months go end, I don't borrow money where past my salary then. Yeah, and one thing about this country is big man, big trouble. The more you earn salary in this country, the more you like to upgrade everything about you. It happens to me. When I was earning one, I mean, sorry, 600 dirhams then, when I was security guard back in 2012, everything was okay for me. When I was earning 1,002, everything was okay, still okay. No, but I mean, no, I don't have, I don't really have much issue then. I, I have got free accommodation. Uh, everything was there. Just my Nigerian food I used to go and buy in there, most case, you know, in, in, as in most times. Everything was okay. I used to save some money. But immediately when I start earning 4,000 plus, that was my second job. <clears throat> Everything about me changed. Oh, I started doing, oh God. I, I started changing my clothing. I changed my phone in everything. So you also need to understand that the more you earn salary in this country, the more expenses you have. So you don't need to depend on that salary because it comes like magic. It goes like magic. It's like magic. Yes, I've, I have experienced that. Hoping that you got something before months we end. Okay, you, you don't borrow past your money. So you need to have side hustling. That's what I'm doing. Yes. Even my wife also. Yeah, my wife sometimes she you know as in she used to 
you know, give me contact from Kenya, people that will buy something for. Yeah, I don't even know them from her contact. I will buy and send. We'll get our own commission from there. That is it. So, see, this is what I do. In, in, most people will not tell you this, but I'm telling you because I want you to survive. I want you to succeed. I want you to have something doing. When you have something doing, you will stop talking too much. Like me, I don't talk too much. Like me, I don't have too much friends. Yeah, you see me. I did my house. I did play my PS4. That is it. It's over there. Yeah, my daughter, once she finished watching her cartoon, I will start playing my PS4. Yeah, I don't have friends. I don't go to anywhere to visit anybody. I, nobody will come to my... I don't, don't come to my house. I don't, I'm not inviting anybody. It's only me with my family. So I will have... You understand? You have time for yourself to think about your future. To think about something. Yeah! Not all the time you'll be going from here to get to... Because, because of one bottle of beer. You forgot everything. One, one bottle of beer. Yeah, so you know, like, who we'll stop all this mingling with you know having circle of foolish friends? Yeah, people that would you know people that will lead you to nowhere. Yeah, so I'm telling you this because I want you to survive. I want you to succeed in this country, like many of us, many Nigerians that succeed. I mean, that succeeded here. Yeah, and stop complaining. Yeah, I know it's not easy. It's not see see. No, beside I'm not a motivational speaker, but I'm just telling you how the team be. How I am doing it, even till now, you understand. Now, let me just briefly mention this. Although I know people might not uh, like, will be against it, but I'm just telling you guys how it can be. Yeah, there's uh, something which a friend of mine um, told, talked to me about. That was February last year. No, no, February this year before Corona started. About Cyro Mall something online something something something. Yeah, so I ignored her. I was like, no, I'm not into networking stuff. No, please don't tell me. So later they changed the name from that uh, Cyro, Cyro or whatever to Shemol. C-H-Y, Mall. So now, someone else now talked to me about it. That was a month ago. And I was like, really? So that's how it works? Yeah, just try. Let her, yeah, this and that. I now invested on it. My dear, I'm telling you, I'm not advising you here or telling you here to go and do it i'm just telling you one of the side hustling which i'm into which i'm doing currently and i'm telling that distant pays this is not networking it's not uh, do uh, this one wearing career mega of it no it's a straight like amazon online it's like conga you yeah it's like you know it's like you, you as in you give a loan to the company so which every 10 days they will pay you in returns so they are paying for the two dollars as per the vip which i'm into my wife the same so that's how it goes so these are the things which you need to be you know be aware of what is happening in your environment but the foolish people will never tell you all these things yeah so you need to make friends with people that have sense people that will tell you it's people that you understand not people that will tell you that yeah, my brother i don't tire for this country this and that yeah, yeah yeah you can still make it in just like what i said before from my previous video you can make it anywhere everything depends on you yeah although the thing not too easy i wish i understand but we need to be pushing it yes you get the point here so that's how it goes we need to be pushing it we need to keep on pushing it you don't we don't need to you know shrink back come on yeah so regarding the issue at hand uh, you know the dubai what it is the uh, issue of niger not giving us visa and all that that one still i understand i've got i'm used to get so many messages on my whatsapp about the issue situations here and there a lot there but we also need to be you know thinking outside something to be doing to be getting some more money so like i was saying before uh, these are the things which currently i'm into and i'm doing it and it's moving so fine you too can as well be doing something of that see i've got like i said before i've got so many of them to say but you two know one or two you understand which you can be doing here yes and you could get guess most more money yeah like the one i was saying about i mean like the one i was talking about before about you know buying things for people yeah that one pays like i know what i'm saying you see this lady's stuff yeah, this they are Peruvian, they are European waves, they are, um, they are Brazilian hair, they are, uh, they, you know, the closure and all, a lot. That's what I mean too. Even this morning, I'm, I'm also arranging for someone else now. Yeah, you get the point. So this is what people are doing to be surviving here. Yeah, you too can be doing that as well. A lot of things. Yeah, you get the point here. 
So not be told you to just you know just sit you know you know with your job there you have got this and that you be doing and you don't have time. Oh guy, you should have time. Oh, if you don't have, like I said before, tell someone that have time. The person will go and check for you. You will get that money and put. That is it. That's the side hustle I'm talking about here. Yeah. So we have got a lot of side hustlings going on here, which you can be doing a lot of them. So you don't need to depend on your salary or to depend on whatsoever. You should be doing something aside from that to be pushing it, to be surviving in case if you mistakenly get issue. Just like me. Before uh, my, I had issue with my, with my last company. Yeah, they were doing this and anyway, I will tell you guys on the, you know the story of it, you know, on a very good day. So you guys will know maybe, perhaps you might have something of that in the future to come. So you know how to handle that kind of situation. Yeah. So I was ready even before the issue arise. I was, I was ready. That's why I didn't even shake. You never even do like say that is no, you know, I lost my job or something. They got it. I mean, they paid me. Yeah. So you understand. So I used the thing was immediately. Yeah, set up something else. Get my residence visa and be doing my business peacefully. Yeah, so you need to have something doing. So in case anything goes wrong, you will not have hypertension. You will not have heart attack. Yeah. So that's it. That's all about this video for today, guys. So, uh, I think I'm going to end this one here for now. Yeah, and I think we're gonna continue. Definitely, we'll continue. Maybe next week or so. Yeah, let me also make some inquiries about some couple of things you can be doing here, which you don't really need to invest. You know, as in cash, capital to start. Just start doing it. Yeah, and be getting some more small money. I will try to dig deep more about it. Yes, yeah, so I will also brief you guys. I'm always here to assist, to help. Yes, that's, I mean, I mean, uh, that's supposed to be our, you know, our main, uh, this thing, to be our brother's keeper, because people are suffering, people are oh, good, what am I even saying, a lot, eh? even the other day, that was uh, two weeks ago, there was a lady which I, I uh, don't know how she got my number from a friend of mine, so she now, uh, she was, uh, she, she's kind of, she lost her job because of the issue, so she really wanted to go back home, so, but she doesn't have enough money for ticket. So I now give her these details, I mean this address for the free flight, which I don't really know if they are still doing it now. I'm just telling you guys how it can be. So she went there, according to her, she, she got Dubai visa, not Abu Dhabi visa then. So it, it, it didn't work for her, but her friends, they took them. So but they didn't uh, took her in. So she now came back. She called me uh, after two days that she didn't su succeed this and that. I, yeah, yeah. She, she tried to raise some cash for ticket, remaining some couple of dirhams to book her ticket. She was really crying and you know like, so at the end I have to do something. So what I'm saying, why I'm saying all this long story, just for let you know that even without your little change where you have, you can as well use it to help someone else, someone near to you where they suffer past you. Yes, that's all this thing is all about. Kindness. It matters a lot. You can never tell how the thing will pay, how, how they go repay you tomorrow. So that's all the thing be. Yes, so we'll go end this one for here now. Let me come go and take some trucks. I know I'm not been feeling well for some couple of days now. So that is it. Thanks, I for your support.